Have you ever wondered what there is in outer space? Well, I mean, the outer space contains many things, as asteroids and, and other celestial bodies, meteoroids as well. So let's see. We can't. We cannot just simply go there and uh, look through. Ast astronomers have been looking into space for generations. E each generation. Once we thought that we, that the Earth revolved, the universe revolved around the Earth, but we proved that theory wrong. We all we all know about space, and we know that it contains, that it's endless. There may be multiple things out there as well. Our our solar system is one of the many solar systems in the Milky Way that rotates around. So the solar, our solar system contains a mul multiple celestial bodies, and each one sometimes even plays a role in our in our in here on our lives at Earth. The moon makes the waves and go go to shore to shore to help around there. And and did you know fifty meteorites come down crashing on Earth? But they all get burned up by our Earth's by Earth's atmosphere. And Earth is protecting us in every way. But we're all we're all like kids. We need to grow up. My idea is an engine. The engine imagine three different rings all fitting into each other, and there is a single hole. Hole. Remember that. These three rings are supposed to conduct conduct energy and propel the spaceship that it was attached to. The only flaw in this is the simple uh, immense power core. The power core would consist of endless energy that it would generate, and it could help as well. It's uh, with the amount of energy it would need to propel a ship is and would be a, a great amount. And the spaceship might go at the speed of light, which is two, which is two point nine nine times. He's 10 to the power of 8 meters per second. But we might get there or might not. It's just an, it's just an experiment. Earth, the Milky Way, has neighboring galaxies as well. And there are multiple solar systems out there. They might contain life or not. Each uh, each so we NASA only got us walking around Earth's atmosphere, but but it also helped us to uh, take uh, pictures at at faraway solar systems that we don't even know about. There might be resources, new new species waiting to be discovered, new planets. This um, this is unbelievable amount of data that we haven't uncovered. We might even go through around our solar system once with my engine. So this is my idea. My name is Shushan Bavap and I'm from Somerset in New Jersey. Thank you.